no tree lighting, no problem. Improvisation resulting in 11 new outdoor experiences in downtown Greensboro and tonight was the beginning of Light of the Night. This will be tonight as well as tomorrow night. We've got a laser light show here with the Dance in Santa Claus among other things. We've got Tinseltown with their 50 interestingly decorated trees in LaBauer Park. Downtown Greensboro says it invested more than $10,000 in new lights for Elm Street. We've got Peppermint Alley right around the corner. We've got Sonic Forest, an internationally known public art piece that's interactive. So there's much, much more, but you know, fun stuff that people can enjoy in a properly social distance way. And a few sprinkles weren't going to put a damper on these displays. Even despite this weather, we've got umbrellas and we're ready to go. With the idea of shop, dine, stroll, open street style. All the shops were open. Uh, hit, 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 right? <laughs> Let's buy some Christmas gifts. None of these people were complaining about the Elm Street shutdown. We went through Tinseltown and we looked at all the little trees and all the decorations over there. We've been listening to the carol carolers all throughout the streets and the jazz band. I mean, in the holiday windows, nothing gets you in the spirit. And gosh, do we need spirit in 2020, right? We need some joy, and those windows just make me so happy. And with more events underway or upcoming, from a holiday window contest to 12 days of meals and a balloon regatta, there are plenty of opportunities to come down and enjoy. Tomorrow is going to be awesome. You know, the holidays are about friends and family. Mask up. Come down. Spend some time in the shops. Grab a bite to eat. Grab a drink. Yeah. It's a great time. In Greensboro, Michael Hennessy, Fox 8 News.